Hi, I'm Congresswoman Terry Sewell of Alabama's 7th Congressional District. I come to you today with a broken heart and a heavy spirit as I mourn with our community for the unspeakable losses that we have endured, not only over the past weeks, months, or years, but over the last 400 years of our nation's history. George Floyd, Breonna Taylor, Ahmaud Aubrey, we say their names as reminders of their humanity because behind each name was a life, a family, dreams, and a future. These names are not statistics. They're not tokens. They're not martyrs. They are human beings, beautiful black human beings who did not want to die for the sins of this country. It is that humanity that we must remember even when we are blinded by rage and blinded by pain. And believe me, I have been feeling both. But as a black woman from Selma, Alabama, who grew up under the shadow of the Edmund Pettus Bridge with the dual histories of racial violence and peaceful protests in my bones, I also know that we must work to direct that anger, not towards violence, but towards action. I stand with the many, many peaceful protesters who are asking this country to live up to its tremendous potential. And I grieve with the mothers, fathers, sisters, and brothers related by blood or by experience who have lost loved ones. I also stand with the family of George Floyd who today have asked for peace and space to grieve. I wish that I had all the answers. I wish that I could give us the solutions that we so desperately need. For now, I promise that I will work tirelessly to do absolutely everything within my power to bring peace and justice to our communities. I pray for peace and I demand justice.